Hi everybody, it's Avishai here again from Piano Freak channel. In this video lesson I'm gonna show you how to play a Montuno, very classic, very useful, with a little solo inside, so stay with me and let's go. Now let's take a look at the chord progression. In this case we have a Montuno and we have solo. So we have a progression for the Montuno and progression for the solo. They are almost the same with a little change inside. Let's take a look. So let's start with the Montuno progression. As you can see, we have four lines of four chords. The first chord will be A minor, like this. With my left hand, I just play the root of the chord. With my right hand, I'm gonna play the notes of the chord. So we have A minor. The next chord will be B7. Then we go to E7. And we go back to A minor. At the second line, we are going to play the same. A minor, B7, E7, and A minor. At the next line, we have A7, like this. And we go to D minor 7. Then we go to G7. And then C major 7. At the last line, we have F major 7. D minor 7, E7, and we finish on A minor. That's the chord progression for the Montuno. If you like my video, don't forget to give me a thumb button. If you are new here, consider subscribe and keep follow all my piano lessons and tutorial. Do it now, subscribe. Let's go. Now I'm going to show you the tumbao, the bass line for the Montuno. I'm going to play it with my left hand. Basically, I'm going to count it like this. The first note is falling on the one, all the other notes are falling on the end of the two and four. The end of the two and four. Let's take a look at the first line and the second line. I'm going to count it like this. One, two, and three, four, 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 one, two, and three. 4, 1, 2, and 3, 4, 1, 2, and 3, 4. At the third line, I'm going to add the beat note, so it sounds like this. 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1. That's it for the tumbao. And now I'm going to show you how to play the Montuno. We have four hands position. The first one will be A minor, like this. Then I take my thumb one step down. This is a B7 flat 9. And then I play E7, like this. And we finish on A minor, like this. So we have one, two, three, and four. And now I'm going to split the note of the chord and I'm going to play it like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. At the third line, I'm going to play it like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's it. Now let's play two hands together. I'm gonna to play it very, very slowly. Check it out. One, two, three, and. Now I'm going to show you how to play the solo. First, let's take a look at the solo progression. It's almost the same. We are using the same chords in a different constructor. So we have A minor, B7, E7, and A minor. Again, for the last time, and 
then we have F major 7, E minor, E7, and A minor. That's the chord progression of the solo. Now I'm going to show you the bass line for the solo. It goes like this. One, two, three, four. 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 One, two, three. That's it. And now I'm going to show you how to play the solo with the right hand. I'm going to do it with my left hand together, but I'm going to do it very slowly so you can follow. One, two, here we go. That's it everybody, I hope you like my video, if you like it don't forget to give me a thumb button, don't forget to write me something in the comment, if you are new here consider subscribe, thank you for watching and see you in the next video.